Hi, Valerie Silvera here today to encourage you to start wearing your oxygen mask. For some of you, you have loaned your oxygen mask out to so many different people, you may not even know where it is. For most of you, you know exactly who's wearing your oxygen mask. But here's the question. Are you going to find the courage to go and get it back? The thing about the oxygen mask is that it is meant for you to breathe your oxygen. See, each of us get our own oxygen mask in this life and it's fine every now and then to loan it to somebody for brief moments to help them, to support them, to give them a hand up with some of your oxygen. But when you have removed that oxygen from your face and you've got it planted on somebody else's, well, they've got their own oxygen mask. They're just choosing not to use it. You need to have the courage to go and get your oxygen mask back because just like in air flight, when you were told by the flight attendants in the case of a loss in cabin pressure and that oxygen mask is released from the overhead, what are you supposed to do? You are supposed to put it on your own face first because if you don't, you're going to pass out or worse. It is time to start breathing that oxygen. Start taking care of yourself mentally, physically, emotionally, and spiritually. While you are so worried about taking care of somebody else, so worried that you've actually loaned your oxygen mask to them or almost given it to them permanently, you are self-destructing. So at the end of the day, you aren't really helping anybody. Because if you self-destruct while somebody else is wearing your oxygen mask, I don't imagine it's going to be very good for them either. So find the courage. Go today and get that oxygen mask back. Put it on your own face. You can do this. Every day I am watching women who are taking their oxygen mask back. And it's incredible what is happening in their lives, even with the storm still raging. You can do this. Find the courage to get your oxygen mask back. You are not alone in this journey. I am standing with you.